Seventh cervical vertebra. It is also known as vertebra prominence due to its long spinous process. Its spine is thick, long and nearly horizontal and is not bifid and ends in a tubercle. The transverse processes are large in size with the posterior root larger than the anterior and the anterior tubercle is absent. Foramen transversarium is relatively small, sometimes double or may entirely be absent and does not transmit the vertebral artery. Attachments Spine Tip of the spine provides attachment to the ligamentum nuque, trapezius, rhomboid minor, serratus posterior superior, splenus capitus, semispinalis thoracis, spinalis cervicis, interspinalis, and multifidus. Transverse process. Posterior tubercle provides attachment to the suprapleural membrane. Foramen transversarium transmits only accessory vertebral vein. The lower border of the process provides attachment to levator costarum. The three atypical cervical vertebrae, C1, C2, and C7, have the following characteristic features. The C1 vertebra, or atlas, is a ring-like, kidney-shaped bone lacking a spinous process or body and consisting of two lateral masses connected by anterior and posterior arches. Its concave superior articular facets receive the occipital condyles. The C2 vertebra or axis is a peg-like dense odontoid process projects superiorly from its body. The vertebra prominence, C7, is so named because of its long spinous process which is not bifid. Its transverse processes are large but its foramina transversaria are small.